Uh, tell me what the Gridiron Greats made you. Well, you know, first of all, you have to do is look at the look at the history of the Gridiron Greats. You look at all of the inductees that have come before us, and uh, it's a remarkable group. And the, the work that Gridiron does uh, to support former players is remarkable. I mean, they really can't say enough about how special a moment this is for anyone, and certainly it's very special for me. So, what other organizations are you involved in? Well, I'm the commissioner of the Canadian Football League, so that's a that's a large full-time job, and you know we have a great relationship with the CFL Players Association, CFL Alumni Association. We do a lot of work with the with the alumni in Canada, and I and I personally do a lot of work with them. Um, and just you know, just generally, my wife and I are involved with a lot of charities in Canada, and uh, we try to do our best to be um, you know, good, good citizens of the planet. So, besides you know being a player. Now you've worked and you've become commissioner. Uh, how has your life been in football and how do you see your succession to where you are today? Well, football teaches, as I, I'm, I'm sure you know, it teaches so many valuable lessons. And you know, for me, my journey from uh, you know being a kid, not a very good student, and then football entered my life, I realized I'd have to go to university, had to, had to learn how to learn. Uh, you know, learning how to learn is a very valuable skill and it's, left, it's opened all kinds of doors for me, including you know, finding my way to the commissioner's office in the CFL. Well, congratulations again, Randy. Thank you. Very thank much. you. Thank you. Thank you.